Victor is an artist. Originally from Zambia, now living in Dubai. His work has been featured in exhibitions in Dubai, Abu Dhabi, and Holland. And many people have commissioned him to paint canvases for them. Some people are naturally talented. But circumstances sometimes deny this talent from ever growing or ever being seen. Um, actually, it was something we just observed when he was about three. That if you try to send him to do something, then he would like try to lip read. If he doesn't get it, he'll just try to wander around and figure out what it is. He was about three years old. Then we took him to the hospital. The first doctor at the public uh, hospital told us, uh, no, he's losing hearing on one side, on the left side. Then we went to the military hospital. Uh, by then his dad was in military. So we went to the military hospital and then there they told us actually he's losing it both sides. The high fever, it was only one night actually, he cried all night. High temperature, we took him to the hospital when he calmed down and that's it. So we didn't realize that caused it, you know, until many months late that we noticed that he's not hearing. Oh, it was such tearful times and time of denial. Couldn't accept it. Then we had to run to other Chinese doctors consulting here and there. And then we went traditional doctors. But in the end, Agba still came to say accept it. He's losing it and there's no restoring to it. Mawahab for Beautiful People is an art studio for adults with special needs. It is here where Victor first learned how to paint and where he has also found good friends. And through the guidance of his mentor Golshan, he has been learning how to grow as an artist and as an individual. Right now, Victor is studying to pursue a bachelor's degree in graphic design. He is fine-tuning his skills as a graphic designer with the help of his friend and translator, Marissa. At one point, Victor told Golshan, My life is just over. I don't have a life. But now Victor has gained confidence in his artistic abilities and most importantly, in himself. Sometimes in life, we are faced with challenges that try to hinder or stop us. But these challenges are meant to be overcome. But these challenges are meant to be overcome. One lesson that can be taken from Victor's story is to believe in yourself. I'm respected as an artist, you know, not as a deaf person. And that's what this painting is all about. Yeah. You know, I, I asked him, who, who are you? Who are you? Who, who is Victor? And he said, Victor is an artist. Victor is African, Victor wants to be famous, Victor wants to be rich. So I said, if I hold a mirror in front of you, how do you see yourself? He said, I see myself as a famous guy, as an artist, you know, rich. But when people look at him, they only see his impairment. They only see that he's deaf. And that's why he's drawn this massive ear. And he wants them to stop focusing so much on that. And look at him as a person, as a human being, as you know who he is, and appreciate him and respect him. Right now, Victor is studying to pursue a bachelor's degree in graphic design.
He is fine-tuning his skills as a graphic designer with the help of his friend and translator, Marissa. to sign as well. Now I'm meeting lots of different people. Now everything's opened. My world has opened up. Gulshan, she wanted to make a, a painting of her daughter as an angel daughter Zara, like showing how she is an angel in character. So I painted it when I was finished. Zara could look at this painting. The purpose was that she could sit in front of the painting and see herself on the wall. At one point, Victor told Golshan, My life is just over. I don't have a life. But now Victor has gained confidence in his artistic abilities and most importantly, in himself. Sometimes in life, we are faced with challenges that try to hinder or stop us. But these challenges are meant to be overcome. 
one lesson that can be taken from Victor's story is to believe in yourself.